Now let's talk about the detection stage. In this stage, a circuit analyzes the signal's level according to certain thresholds. If the signal is below the threshold, then there won't be any change. If the signal goes above the threshold, then there will be a gain reduction. The threshold is the most important knob in a compressor as it allows us to set the amount of compression. The lower the threshold, the more compressed the signal will be. In most compressors, the user can adjust the threshold, but in some models, the threshold is fixed and the user can adjust the input level instead. In this case, a higher input will give us more compression. In other designs, we can adjust both actually. So in some cases like those, my recommendation is to set the input to 0 dB and use the threshold to adjust the amount of compression. In the detection stage, we could also find RMS or peak settings. RMS stands for root mean square and takes an average of the signal's voltage. On the other hand, a peak detection works only on the signal's peaks, as we can see in the image. Each one has a different effect in the sound, being the peak setting a little more aggressive than the RMS. The reduce depends on taste. Many compressors don't have this feature and the setting is determined by a factory design, which is usually RMS, by the way.